Hi! How's everyone doing this evening? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited that you're here. So I have a Timu haul. Now it's not a ton because I picked up something um, that cost $25 this time. So I really watched my spending and you know, um, but I did got some really great stuff. Some new stuff I haven't gotten yet before. So like, I don't think I have any repeat orders, um, but I got some things I think you guys will really think is interesting. So I'm happy and excited to share it. Okay. If you're subscribed to my channel, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're not, I hope this video will help you decide. Um, I love DIYs, I love paper crafting, I love hauls, I love shopping. Who doesn't love shopping, right? Like, I love shopping. Okay, so let's go ahead and get right into the video because I wanna be able to share the prices. I will put the links in my description box down below. Um, you guys, I love comments. I would so appreciate a big thumbs up. Um, it just means a lot to my channel, helps me grow. You know, all those YouTube -y things that we ask you to do, it really does make a difference and it's so much appreciated. Okay, so Timu. Okay, let's get started. So what I have, what I'm gonna start with is my $25 uh, item, which I'm really super excited to have. Okay, so I decided to get one of these irons, these little mini, you know, they're actually a dupe for Cricut, I believe. That's what I think they are anyway. A little Cricut dupe, right? Um, I got the purple one, okay? And I've already used it to iron some things. I actually ironed, my son was in a wedding today and I ironed his suit with it. Um, it goes up to, oh my goodness, what was, I think it goes up to 400 degrees. I'm almost positive it's 400 degrees. And it came with a couple, um, well, it came with instructions. It came with a bag that I ironed as well. That's the first thing I ironed. I want to see if it worked. And um, it came with some transfers that you could transfer on. One was a strawberry. I don't, I've got them put away, guys. I should have kept them out. I'm sorry. Um, and I think the other one was like a Hello Kitty or something. But anyway, so I thought about putting it on the bag, but I really didn't want to do that. So I'll end up ironing it on something and show you guys in a short or something, okay? But here she is, all purple and beautiful. Now, do I think this iron's gonna last forever? Absolutely not, but it's definitely worth the $25. You know, I love the little carrot, the little holder that you have so that nothing gets burnt. Um, yeah, and so there's the power button, there's the temperature button, and um, yeah, it works great. I'm super excited to have it. I've been tempted to buy this so many times and I was like, oh, I'm so afraid I'm gonna get it and it's not gonna be great. I read some reviews. I didn't see any bad reviews on it. So I thought, you know, let, it's $25. Let's go ahead and check it out. I'm really happy that I did. I absolutely love this iron. Love it. I love this little packaging, this little bag that you can put it in. It's so cute, right? Like, look at it. It's so cute. Get it in the package. And then I'll put it in my closet with all my other crafting tools. I cannot wait to be able to buy a house and have like an area or clean up my garage, one or the other, and have an area to um, like keep my tools up on. And, but anyway, so once you neatly do this, it'll all fit in the bag. <laughs> Look at me. That's, what a way to keep my um, iron from not breaking, right? I'm just throw in the cord in there. But look, there you go. Oh, I love it, love it, love it. And that was $24.59. Okay, I got these flowers, obviously for Halloween. Okay, let me see. They weren't very expensive and I didn't get a ton because I wanted to see what they were about. It's two yards for $1.49. They're both the exact same price. And I mean, they're really pretty cute. Like I took them, they were just kind of thrown in there. I took them out and rolled them up. But um, yeah, I really like them. I think they're gonna look great on some Halloween packages, you know, or some Halloween um, crafts. So yeah, love it, love it, love it. Okay, so $1.49, two yards. I don't know if that's a great deal or not. I have no idea. Um, you know, it seemed like a good deal, so I picked it up. 
Okay, I got some more of those flowers. Uh, this time I got the pink. I think the last one I got was the white or the pearl. This was 150 pieces for $1.79. Now my friend Sharon from um, Cheap on the che Cheap to Chic, she actually um, sent me a message that has a way better deal on Amazon for these. Cause you get like, I don't know, 500 for five bucks or something. It's a really incredible deal. So once I play with these and the white ones, if I like them, which I can't imagine that you wouldn't like these in the middle of your flowers. And I got pink so that I can use it for Christmas. Well, or any time, but like, I really wanna do, I wanna do pink Christmas this year. Okay, and these, what I, I already said the price, $1.79 for 150. Okay, and you know me and my charms. I love charms so much. I think I love them so much because um, I've never had them before and so I've tend to go on a little crazy, but you need them, especially if you're gonna be like in swaps and stuff and to add to your to your um, projects. But look, these are all ghosts. There's 10 of them and the ghost is flying on his, on his or her broom, right? Aren't they so cute? These were for 10 of them. They were, da, 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 they were 224. 224 for 10. Okay, now, so that's those. We'll put those away really quickly. Okay. I got these avocados because I bought Scrap Diva's, um, I can open it. I bought her toaster and toast. And I thought, how cute would these avocados look on that uh, on that project, right? Like, I mean, super cute, right? Look at the avocados. That's a pretty nice size too. Let's see if we can see how big they are. Like, I was surprised how big they were. They're right at about a little over, they're about an inch and a half big. So that's pretty good if you ask me. I mean, they seem very large. Yep, so there we go, okay now okay um i only got a couple more charms here i got these i don't think i bought these same pumpkins before but then when i got them i was like maxine did you buy these already so i don't remember if i did i'm gonna have to go through my charms i hope i bought a different pair a different set i don't quite think it was these when you buy these these metal ones where they're all metal, they're really, really inexpensive. Like these were a dollar seven for 10 of them. So barely a dollar for 10 of them. And they're so cute, right? I love that they're, so it's gonna be a perfect fall or Halloween. I mean, he doesn't really have a scary face or anything, but he's cutesy, he's a cute little pumpkin. Okay. Um, and here's the next one. I, you haven't noticed, I've been ordering a lot, a lot of Halloween because I was not prepared last year for Halloween at all. And this year I really wanna be prepared. Okay, look at these ghosts. There's 10 of these ghosts for, they are uh, 258. But look, it's a big old ghost and he's sticking his tongue out. <laughs> I thought he was cute, right? I think he's so adorable. So, so cute. Okay. Talk about Halloween, you guys. I went to Joanne's today because I heard they had their Halloween fabric out and I just went to look. I didn't plan on buying anything yet. I still have time to buy. But um, I just kind of wanted to get, you know, like a look and oh my gosh, you guys, they are full blown code orange Halloween everywhere like seriously um so i'm hoping to get that video up all i'm gonna do is put all the clips together and post it um because i talked through the whole thing okay these are pumpkins um okay come on now um oh come on don't do this to me now i just lost my Okay, these are pumpkins. I did buy um, a set of these last time, but I think they were pink and these are orange. I wanted orange for um, or for fall. Because I get so confused, like why my phone is way over there, but I have to move way over here for <laughs> I don't get it. Okay, super cute, super cute, super cute. 
Okay, I hope that I can get this pulled back up so I can keep giving you guys the prices. Bear with me for just a moment while I try to go back and... Oh, there it was, darn it, Maxine. Okay, let me go to Timu order. Okay, here we go, right here. Okay, um, okay, so I got these. I don't remember putting two of these, they're beads. The beads go right through the top and the bottom, not side to side. Well, it could be side to side, but I mean, it doesn't go through the, the lemon or the lime is what I meant. Like you can, you know, you can see the whole lemon and the whole lime. These were, the limes were $1.34 for 30 of them. The lemons were 30 for $1.34. So I think they're really cute. I think they're gonna look good on, you know, my, my projects for the summertime. But yeah, I'm really happy to have these. They, and they're a little bit bigger than just your normal, um, like, uh, sequence you know these are a tiny bit bigger and so they really make an impact i feel like and plus the fact that they're a charm or that you know they're like almost like a bead i thought that was cool okay now i bought the, these last time i bought these are magnets and i bought the tiny ones that was like barely as big as my tip of my finger so this time i got these which they're not quite as big as a dime like not at all but they're definitely bigger and these were, I think it was 20 of them. Tw um, yeah, 20 of them for $249. i am just excited to be able to craft and have these to make my, look, did you see how like that like snaps? Look at that, and it's so hard to get apart. <laughs> so these are definitely gonna make many albums easier. Plus the other ones I have too, I'm really happy to have those. Okay, these are just garment pins and all kinds of colors. I've got silver bronze and gold they are um i have bought um garment pins before but i really just wanted more for um tags and i'm gonna do a lot of tags this christmas a dollar seven for a hundred pieces love it love it love it okay i only have a few more things here oh i finally got myself a pair of wire cutters i've been using um these things right here on my dies and it's so hard to get inside the little pieces right whereas if this is so tiny you know oh I'm so happy to have this like so happy this was two dollars and 49 cents oh I'm just it's little it fits in my hand really nice it moves easy this is ugh, I don't know it's it cuts great flowers and stuff but it's not meant for dies I feel like so I'm really happy to have that Okay, and let's see, what's next? Oh, these. Now I have a silhouette and I have a Cricut. So I could definitely have done these on my Cricut or my silhouette, but these were like 48 cents. These were 49 cents for three. Now I have to say, I thought they were bigger. <laughs> like I thought they were going to save me like a whole piece of vinyl, but <laughs> that's not true. <laughs> It just saved me a tiny itty bitty piece of vinyl. <laughs> just a little bitty bitty one. But still, this is going to be really cute on some projects, right? Like, look how cute. A ghost, a pumpkin, and Jack Skeleton. And for 50 cents, you know, you can't beat it. Put them on, on Christmas bulbs. Put them on, um, I mean, there's so much you can do. Make little projects or make little projects for your uh, tier tray. You know, put them on blocks. There's just so much you can do. Same with this, okay? These are packs of 10. And um, again, I could have done this myself on my silhouette or my Cricut, but why when I can just buy them? This is a 10 pack for $1.59. So I got 40 of them. Um, because I am a terrible weeder and weeder and I, when, when I weed my vinyl, oh, you guys, I get so frustrated. Like it upsets me. It's not fun anymore when I'm trying to weed something this small. So for a dollar, what I say, a dollar 59 for 10 of them, I thought just for the aggravation alone to have 40 of these, I mean, and I think this is such a great, great, I'm so excited. Like, I love these so, so much. I cannot wait to use this this Christmas. Okay, I have two more things. 
I was really good this time. I'm trying to slow down on my dyes because I just have too much. <laughs> I just placed an order today at Alley. <laughs> oh, what's wrong with me? Okay, so I thought I saw this on Sharon's channel, which is um, Cheap to Chic. Um, you guys obviously can tell her and I are good friends. <laughs> um, but she said she saw this on my channel. I think what she saw was I had the charms for this, you know, this balloon dog. But I think hers was bigger than this. Mine, this is very little. It's so cute. I love it. I'm not, you know, but you guys know me when it comes to dyes. I'm always like, I thought it was going to be bigger. So from bottom to top, it's about, what am I doing? I'm doing it in centimeters, not inches. Okay, let me see here. Um, from top to bottom, it's about a little, not almost two and a half inches. So, but I mean, you know, that's cute. It'll look good on a card. It'll look good on a little project. So, you know, I like it. And then I can't believe I only bought two dies. Like I really have got to slow down. Like I don't even have the dies I have organized. I have so many that I'm not using them like I'd like to. So yeah. And I'm trying to go back to doing a whole lot more DIYing than paper crafting on my channel. So, you know, paper crafting for me is a lot of fun. Don't get me wrong. I absolutely love it, but Okay, and then this is, oh, I didn't tell you how much the dog was. The doggy was, okay, this one here, the Dracula, the, um, the Dracula cup is $249. I cannot wait to put this together. I think it's going to be so, so cute. But the balloon doggy was $249. So both of these were $249, and I love them because they fit in my, my little uh, new way to package my dies. Like I've been putting, I was putting tape on here with a name, but lately I've turned into, I take it like this. I cut a piece of paper. I gotta get another one there. I need to order some more cause I've already gone through 200 of these, which tells you I've, I have 200 small dies and I don't, I'm nowhere near putting my, um, <laughs> my dies together. Okay, so I take this, right? And then I get an ink pen or a marker. I've been using markers, okay? And I've been writing Timu on it. Halloween. Okay, we'll put Dracula Cup. And then I bought it in June of 23, okay? So I've got that like that. And then I let this dry for just a second. I put it in here, but where you can see it. I obviously want you to be able to see it, right? And then I take some washi tape. Now, none of this is cut apart yet, so I don't have to worry about anything falling out of it. So I don't really have to put a ton of tape on it. But once, you know, it's all cut apart, I'll make sure I cover all of the um, the edges and stuff. But then I just take this. Put, oh, I didn't do that very straight. That's a problem I have. I can't ever get my tape on straight, ever. No matter how hard I try. Okay, there's that. And then I'll take my little doggy here and I'll put him in here, okay? Again, I'm gonna take my little piece of paper here. Okay, I'm gonna put Timu, balloon dog, Timu. Okay, balloon, B-A-L-L-O-W, balloon? No, I'm spelling that all wrong. How about, okay, we'll put Timu. I'm gonna put B and then dog so I can make sure I spell balloon right. <laughs> Six of 23, okay? So I'm gonna cut this. I can't believe I balloon, B-A-L-L. Oh, B-A-L-L-O-O-N, balloon. I think that's right. B-A-L-L-O-O-N, balloon. It looks right. I'm a horrible speller, guys. Horrible. And yes, I graduated high school and I went to college. <laughs> I've always been a terrible speller. Don't ask me how I ever got through college. With My professor was like, Maxine, it is not okay that you do not um, <laughs> try to spell better. I'm like, what do you mean? <laughs> Nowadays, you just say, hey, Siri, how do you spell? And you're, you're in there. Okay, so now I'll take these and I will put them in my Halloween and in my everyday is what I call this one here. Okay, you guys, so that's my haul. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope you liked everything I got. Thank you so, so much for stopping by. I'm so grateful. I can't even tell you how grateful I am. 
and um, I'll see you guys on the next one. All right, bye-bye.